guys, it's Stacky Fatters here and welcome back to another video in Stormwork. Today we are checking out this awesome creation here, which is a, I can't remember, basically it's a, like a hover vehicle that, um, it's great waypoint system, currently I just set it off to the Arctic, I think we're close to about halfway, it's going quite well, and it also has another little secret that we will test out later in the video. So we are now just about in the Arctic, we're just pulling up now, so I believe I did put on, wait, what's going on, let me have a look in front of it, doesn't it look cool, so nice, I love this, let's just um, change it to uh, daytime, there we go, so that uh, we can see it landing there in about sun, yeah, a bit before, oh, nearly missed it, it's landing there, so I did put it on, I believe, landing automatically, so, oh, that was a very hard landing, jeez, um, yeah, so, we'll just have a look at the vehicle quickly. Very nice, like a sleek design. Um, and where's the... Yep, we'll turn off our autopilot and our autopilot can land. And then we're going to set it so that when we do a little transmission on our little radio it should theoretically come and pick us up so let's go put ahead and put on lights get out of our seat go out the top oh, top top hatch or we can just yeah we can just teleport to I don't know yeah about about there yeah Where are I can't see him. Where are we? Oh, okay, we're, we're in like the bottom of the mountain thing. Here, let me just uh, let me just get out of here quickly. So we are now out of the hole, and we'll just get up to the top of this little ledge here if we can, so that it's got a clear area if it some reason lands even though I said it not to land um, come on there we go so we'll jump onto our little radio channel zero is what it runs on and uh, so, yep yeah, up to there and then we press L and B or left click and then we just hold it there we go should now be on its way so I guess um, yeah, we'll just play the uh, waiting game, looking with our um, looking with our binoculars, and actually, let's just set a waypoint so we can uh, see sort of which direction it will be coming from. There we go. So that direction. So um, I'll keep a look at and I'll keep you updated of when it arrives. So we had a few problems and I've just had to reset it and change the location of the uh, the radio tower thing because I think that was what the problem was. We are on top of Mount whatever this thing is and I have called it in I believe. I kind of want to go check on where I launched it from but I don't because I'm pretty sure it is coming. But I am actually just going to go check on it quickly. It is actually a pretty fast vehicle so i got to do this very quickly, very quickly. Uh, top of here, go, go, go. Yes, yeah, definitely gone, I believe. It's not here. 
it's gone somewhere at least. We're probably going to miss it now. Come on, come on, come on. Do I see it? See, I believe it possibly could smack into the side of the mountain. <laughs> which is uh, a bit strange. But which... Where am I? Okay, so a bit to the left, it seems. Wherever I call it, so... Don't see any crashes. So I probably should have spawned the center of the vehicle instead of with the mission editor. Um, just so I can see where it is, I guess. Um, but this was just easier for me. Should probably would have been easier doing the opposite. But, um, yeah, I don't see it yet. Remember, guys, if you do want to see more Stormworks, um, smack the like button, please. And subscribe if you're new. Hmm. You know what? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go get another vehicle. And by the time I've got another vehicle, hopefully it would have either got here or I know it's not going to go there. So, we're going to go teleport here. And we're going to go get the same thing. Oh, where's the opening door thingy? Can I do it from here? No, I have to go on the inside. So um, I'll meet you back when I've got my uh, my vehicle. So here we've got our new vehicle. Now the other one still should be going. And with this one, I'm just going to set it up on the waypoint there. Because how long it takes for it to get there should be about the same. It should take... Uh, let me get in. Hello? Let me get in. But you have to leave it a while and then it should. There we go. E for engines. Light switch on. And then we'll pop in our waypoint. Now we won't switch it to that first. H controls, what do we have to do? Um, and just move it. Are we just moving it forward? Hey, we're doing it. Yahoo! Oh, oh, oh. Stop! Oh my gosh. Okay, we're getting a new one. Yay, that was fun. Look at me flying. So how about I just go to the waypoint? Because it should be there, I reckon. Please be here. No, I don't see it. It's not in there, is it? I feel like it's crashed. Hmm. This is weird. Um, let me just go back to the place where I tested it earlier today because I know that it works there, so be right back. So here we have our two creations, perhaps the, uh, like the antenna of this beast. So let's hop into the seat, let it focus, whatever. Let's flip the engines on, we don't want the autopilot to land. Lights on, autopilot on, and mission transponder on. Now we're going to hop to this island because I've tested here before. Teleport here. So now I'm pretty sure it is a zero, but we just talk. I don't know how long I have to do it for. I'm just gonna keep holding it. 
and stop. Sorry, it should, which way is it coming from? Just gonna set a waypoint there so we can send it back and also so I know which direction. So I'm just gonna move over to the edge of this plateau. That's if it is a, I don't, it's probably not a plateau. And let's just see if we can see it. So what I'm thinking is it actually might be out of its range because I forgot, sorry, this isn't where I tested it. I tested it on the edge of the runway because it might be limited to the area because it's a mission and said that I loaded in. Um, I think maybe. So if I just go teleport and we make sure that Because what I'm thinking, what? Do we have two? I don't remember having a second. We'll have a. We'll go over to it, I guess, via waypoint now. Now that we have another one spawned in and out in the open. I don't remember getting this one. Not sure what this one's for. For is that have I been in this one? Maybe, maybe not. Okay, let's get our waypoint coordinates in. Lights on. Engine on. And is it going to the waypoint? Yeah, it is. So, we should get there the same time as the other one. But what I'm thinking happened is that, like the edge of the area maybe. Also, if there's any, something in the way, like, I don't know. But we'll just see what happens. Yeah, it's there. It's there. So, I guess we can show you guys... Um, what happens to it? So I guess we'll go down. Oh, it's doing flares? I didn't know it did flares. A uh, mate. You're going to stop? So we'll just do uh, autopilot can land. And it's going to bang us into the ground. There we go. Can we open the door? There we go. And let's just run over to here. Excuse me. There we go. So what it does is it flies over to where you call the radio. Then it drops flares and it drops these harnesses. Now you actually have to get into the control harness and then hold two and it will start winching you up. So we're just gonna get winched up into our new transport back to our base. I'll just quickly go plot in a waypoint. And also a cool thing, when you're in, it will close the door, but can't see anything because the stupid flares. Uh, get out of here. Did I put it in? Is it gonna go? Is it going? Nope. Um, now, there we go. Quickly. Get out of here before we like. I know. Oh my. Did we. Did we just whack into something? I think we 
just did like a backflip. Jeez. Anyway, um, I think we might end it here. So, um, oh, also, there's oh, lots of, oh, I forgot to show you other features. Hold up, don't leave yet. So, of course, we have our beautiful flares that we're just going to deploy so there aren't any for it to deploy. Very nice. We do have a radio on this, and we have, like, the whole crew. A seat to the back and a maintenance hatch. So I actually called it at the end of the runway, just there. So it's really cool how it does this, like it turns around. Now, you can see our two little beacons things. And I did set it to land, but every time it lands, it seems to smack into the ground. So I'm hoping this time it's a bit better. That time is better, but don't whack into this thing. Oh, does it think this is the ground? I think it thinks this is the ground level. So, what we can do, we can just do this. Hop into our control harness. Is it one? And we can just winch ourselves down. Very nice. So, um, yeah, guys, um, thanks for watching the video today. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. And, um, ooh, whoa, I don't think we went to see it. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.